Sup y'all, it's me, it's your boy Asmongold, and today I wanted to show you guys something that has been very, very long overdue, and also something that I've really been looking forward to. Blizzard finally created their own official Blizzard voice chat system. It's called Blizzard Voice Chat, and it's accessible through the Battle.net launcher. You can use it to talk to your friends while you're playing Blizzard games, or you actually don't even have to be logged into any sort of a game. You just have to be logged into your Battle.net account to use it, so you don't even have to use it through any sort of a game, like the old one back in Burning Crusade that a lot of people probably hopefully forgot about. So I'm going to go ahead and take you guys through all the features that this has and also I'm going to include a clip of the audio just so you guys can get a gauge on how the quality is. Uh, my buddy and Mick Levy talked on it for a while and uh, TLDR, long story short, it's actually pretty good. I, I think this is a really, really great, this is the first time we've seen this, it's a really, really great first version of this and I do want to emphasize that too. At this point, it's very, very bare bones. There are things that you can click on URLs. That's like the big, oh boy, you got a fucking extra exclamation point next to that so it's not like this is not as advanced as discord or anything like that but the important thing i think is that this is the first step and i really really hope this can lead into something bigger and so i'm going to give my uh, my criticisms and my suggestions for where i think that they can really take this to really I think like in a game like World of Warcraft or like Diablo and like a fantasy, like an MMO game, allowing people to talk to each other and giving them that personal interaction, that extra step of personal interaction can really help them create bonds and really make friends and really take things to, uh, I guess, literally kind of the next level. So in order to actually use this, you can go ahead and open up, you just have your battle.net page, open up your friends list, click on create channel. And um, obviously Blizzard is a, uh, a hacking, uh, hacking organization. So I had to allow it through my firewall. And then you can invite people through the channel. Now, in just a second here, I'm going to go ahead and have a, you know, and cut myself out and you guys can listen to it. But basically, you just go ahead and add one person to your channel. And this basically, these channels kind of take the place of the old conversations that Blizzard took out of the game. So a lot of uh, cross-realm RPers, I believe, are going to be pretty happy to see that come back as well in this facility. So as you guys will see in just a second here, uh, pretty much all you have to do is click on that button that says start voice chat. And then after that, uh, pretty much everything else is just you just talk to that person and uh you know that's pretty much it it's really not very complex at all so i'll go ahead and let you guys hear it oh hey yo yo can you hear me yeah yeah let me find out you're making a video on this oh shit wait what are you making a video on on this like new thing i'm recording right now <laughs> <laughs> oh shit yeah dude so it works it works apparently yo it sounds good though have you used it before no, like, I was like, what is this noise? Yeah, I was like, what the f***? So, as you guys can see, I think that the auto come, comes across very, very well, and you can just go ahead and take a look at the settings right there, and it has push-to-talk activation, it has mute keys for open mic. I usually like to just do open mic because I, I love to talk, and so, obviously, as you can see, um, you know, I like to use open mic, but a lot of other people like to use push to talk. Both of those options are available. You can choose what mic that you want. And there are a lot of other things like that. I don't really know how many people that you can have in a channel at a time. So some of the things that I'd really like to see added into this. And um, also, as you guys can see, I'm going to see right near. Um, as you can see right under the X there for closing the window, the green thing means that you're actually inside the voice chat. The, uh, the little person with the plus mark obviously means that you're going to add somebody into the call. And the gear obviously means just like every other app, those are the settings, right? So it's very, very simple to use. I think basically anybody can figure this out. So I really hope that they introduce this and add it for uh, different groups and raids and things like that and allow people to create channels with each other without actually having to be battle tag friends. I think that'll really kind of make things easier and also give players a way to create their own channels uh, like have a person to where you can join different channels like a guild channel I think that every guild should have their own specific channel and then sub channels inside of that they could be set up through the guild leader or uh, officers I think those would be really really good first steps for this uh, this program to take and I really hope that uh, obviously they're gonna be able to do that as you can see you can test the volume on your microphone your speakers you can even click on that and then hear your 
your self-talk. There's a ton of other things that you can do. Well, actually not really, but there's a couple of other things you can do that I pretty much already showed you guys. So anyway, guys, uh, I just wanted to give you a quick heads up and show you how this is working. I think this is a great first step. This is something that I'm really, really glad that Blizzard has been doing. Uh, it should have been done a long time ago, but honestly, I'm just happy that it's being done now. I really hope that they can build on this and really integrate it into their games to make their games more social and to feel more alive and that you're acting with real players or uh, acting with and playing with real players. I think that'll be really important and maybe the first step towards getting people a little bit more social. Uh, I, I think like back in like 2006 and everything, people got on Vin all the time, but people don't really do that a whole lot now because there's like eight different chat programs, right? So giving their like an actual, like an in-game chat program that you don't need to download something from another website, you don't need to get an IP address or anything like that, a server password, you can just join these voice chat systems and be invited to them, you know, like really, really easily. I think this is going to be really, really great for the game. Uh, for World of Warcraft, they can really integrate this in a lot of other better ways. So I want to hear from you guys, what would you really like to see inside this voice chat system? And also, do you guys really see this voice chat system overtaking or replacing uh, Curse Voice or uh, Ventrilo or Discord or Skype or whatever for a lot of people personally? I don't really know. It really kind of depends on how they, uh, how they curate it and how they facilitate it and how they kind of build it from here on out. So anyway, guys, uh, really, really good news. Hopefully this can improve and, you know, actually be something that really is awesome. And so let's hope that's going to happen. But until then, thank you for watching and like, comment and subscribe.